Welcome to Dungeons & Dragons Dark Alliance. A non-stop, heart-pounding, kill everything that moves action brawler with co-op. The story. Dark Alliance takes place in the frigid world of Icewind Dale. You might need to take a sweater. You will explore varied and iconic locations in the frozen north, including Kelvin's Cairn, this is it, the Hinterlands, and Dwarven Valley. Here lies the ancient and powerful Crystal Shard. If it falls into the wrong hands, darkness could blanket this realm. So naturally, this power attracts legendary monsters, and they've formed a dark alliance. They've set aside their differences to capture the Shard and its powers. You and your party are the only ones standing in their way. So you're quite important. The party. This is Drizzt. He's fast, he's powerful, he's got two Zeds in his name, and as a trick he does at parties sometimes, he can summon this big gal. Catty Bree. Ranged or up close, she's in control of the battlefield. I wish I could do that. Wolfgar. He's the muscle. Big hammer. Big power. Big everything? Who's to say? Bruna, the protector. Look at his resplendent beard. He can take a beating, but he'll give one back. The combat. In Dark Alliance, combat is everything. Each hero has over 50 moves and abilities to unlock, which is only slightly more than myself. I have 49 and a half. If you think that sounds too hardcore, it's not for me. Don't worry, we've created an emergent combat system that will easily have your character switching between the most epic attacks in the game. Whoa. 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 Of course, if you do want to get hardcore, and who doesn't sometimes, there's a lot to master. You have light, heavy, and special attacks that can be chained together into powerful combos. Ooh, glad that's not me. And you have dodges, parries, and counters to defend against the hordes of enemies. I'm just going to warn you, though, these attacks and counters deplete your stamina, which you definitely don't want to run out of mid-combat. Trust me, I've done it. It's embarrassing. Then there are more powerful abilities and ultimates that deplete your ultimate meter. That gets filled the better you do in combat. There's also attacks like empowered strikes, which can deal devastating critical damage on a successful hit. The enemies. Look at these a-holes right here. I bet they didn't get enough hugs as baby goblins. Throughout your journey, you're going to run into over 30 different enemy types. And of course, if you're fighting minions, that means there's bosses. Big bosses. Huge bosses, which is like big bosses, but bigger. Probably some bosses that always call without texting first. Even new bosses being added throughout the year that I haven't even seen yet. Take on any boss in the army in any order you want, although I'd start with this one because he threw mud at me. The gear. What's D&D without loot to grab, collect, and make your own? As you level up your character, you can level up your gear, decking out your hero at base camp before each mission. Your loot will range from common all the way up to legendary status. And there's no microtransaction here. If you want the best gear, you need to earn it one battle at a time, the way my grandmother did. The co-op. You can absolutely take on this adventure on your own. But sometimes stabbing evil creatures with pointy weapons is just more fun to do with friends. It's a well-loved social activity. Dark Alliance was made to be played with others, so you can jump into a quick play or make a custom game all your own. When you play together, you unlock new attacks and abilities for your team. Each hero has a unique way to trigger team attacks. Ha ha ha! Wow, that looked very intense. And everyone has their own special attack. Dealing out devastating damage. But be warned, the bigger your team gets, the tougher the monsters become. Well, we hope you enjoyed hearing about Dark Alliance. And remember, if you find yourself in possession of the crystal shard that gives you ultimate power, because it happens, try not to be a dick about it. Dungeons and Dragons, Dark Alliance.